Who am I thinking of? Well, I'm, it's when I hear Rom, I think of Romeo, the old school Captain Falcon. <laughs> but that's too obscure. I, I for was talking people. about Romeo the other day. Nice. Yeah, we, yeah. Last night we were talking about him. Okay, Rom the Falco. I feel like I have seen him. And yeah, Skurzo's from Chicago. I know Skurzo. Mm -mm. Getting right into it. Ooh. I smashed the eye right on that up air. Yep. But still, Skurzo's just all over Rom. Yeah, Rom's going to go ledge there. Ooh, not nice. a good trade. Always got to respect Fox on that side platform, prepped to do a shield drop back air. On the platforms in general, man. Yeah. Fox on a platform is hard for Falco to deal with in, in general. Ooh, nice damage from Skurzo. Okay, what's mm -hmm. Rom's punish game look like? Nice, that's pretty good. Yeah, yeah I mean, that's it, KO. it's not what you, it, the prettiest thing you could do, but it's a DI mix-up that works, so yeah. that's actually what matters. He did the hard part, which, which was just positioning himself to cover that roll in. Yeah, he exactly. Had, he had a solid read on that one. Yeah. Nice damage from Skurzo. Ooh, <sighs> wait, he still has a jump. Nice shorten. That was great by Rom to recover after those jabs. I thought he was dead for sure. Yep. Oh, oh, wow. That DI back on up throw actually getting converted into shine. Yeah. Yeah, actually not getting hit by the lasers is bad uh, as Fox. <laughs> because then you can get shined, whereas you can SDI the lasers out. Yeah. Okay, good trade for Rom there, but Skurs is going to escape on the platform. Okay, gets a little stuck. There. Nice. Yep. Milking that hit stun until the down air angle mm -hmm. worked just right. Right. I gotta like pay attention Ooh. to the neutral now because their punish game has just been like 80% of the match. Yeah, this is so fast. And <laughs> they are just scrapping right now. Yeah. Rom, Rom going right back in. Full hop getting blown up though by Skurzo. Ooh, that's a good trade for Rom actually. Mm -hmm. Nice power shield again. Oh, Ooh, Jesus. Double. That's like the third one he's hit. No ledge dash. Is he gonna do it again? Yeah. Eh, it'll work. Whenever you see a fox doing that, you can, you can just tell they're they're, they're feeding up for another one. Yeah, they're, yep. they're gearing their ECB up for a ledge dive. <laughs> wow. wow. Oh my god. I thought he was just going to grab him again. Wow. This last stock from Scarzo. Okay, Oof. okay. He is going to die, maybe, or at least get hit off stage. Really good DI is the problem. Yeah. yeah. Rom struggling to close this out. Decent recovery. Well, I'm starting to slow it down a little bit more, but it might be too little too late. Okay, that's big. What do you Lasers do here? What do you down. do here? Oh, you got to get the happy feet dash attack there. Shout out yeah. to Zoo. Yeah, exactly. Oh, my God. Nice. What? Almost 200% for Skurzo. Rom does close it out. <gasps> oh, I love the idea, but... Oh, oh, unfortunate. Two side Bs that just did not go where he wanted them to. Yeah. Just barely. Rom definitely came alive, though, in those last two stocks. Yeah, I think he started playing a little bit more patient and actually made his gameplay a little bit more nuanced and varied. And, and yeah, and back this, to Battlefield. This is losers of our uh, pool here, so. Oh, yeah. Best of three. This is potentially Rom's last game here. Down air caught Fox, Fox in the air. Not as much hit stun. And wow, that, that's a really tough thing to go for that Skurza was attempting the instant side B after yeah, hit stun. It's hard. It's really hard for Falco to cover, though, if you get it. Because if they commit to the instant laser, like like Rom did afterwards, then you get out for free. They need to actually wait and react with a down smash. Right, Skurzo taking platform. Oh, and Rom ready to just take the issue right to him. Okay. okay. Oh, yeah. He's been confident on some of these tech chases, but then occasionally just has a little bit of a flub. He's misspaced a lot of the shine tech oh. chases, just barely, actually. Okay. Those double lasers from Rom were right in Skurzo's face. Yeah, they were. <laughs> Boom. Ooh. Beautiful lasers. Nice. And I, I like the forward air. Yeah. Keep it simple. Just r rinse and repeat, but barely misses the fade back by Skurzo. Nice recovery. Yeah. Okay. I was going to say, I like the forward air, too. That move's knockback is underrated. It can actually send pretty far. It, exactly. And it's way more, it's way easier to hit <laughs> than, than a back air or something there, so. When Rom finds a nice 13 there, credit to that uh, ledge cancel side B that he just hit. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. So quick on these throw follow-ups. Yeah. So, so quick that I think Skirzo's not having time to DI them the way he might usually. Yep. 
Fox such a light character, so he gets thrown so quickly, actually. Yeah, exactly. That's actually a good point. Yeah, tough to deal with Fox coming down from top platform there as Falco. Mm -hmm. You do have to kind of wait Oof. it out. And nice shine turnaround back here from Scurso. That was beautiful. Yeah, when Fox gets to the top platform, you sort of, it's just a stalemate situation for mm -hmm. Falco a lot of the time. You can't really jump up like that because if the Fox is ready for it, then he just has the advantage a lot of the time. What you can do is contest them going to the top platform, which is maybe what Rom's going to start trying to do. You try to catch them with your own dare. God wow. damn. Wow. Oh, the laser! He's good. <laughs> okay, but he's so fine. many foxes would have tried to shine turn around back air, yeah, but yeah. just the nair was actually the simplest option there. Wow. Okay. So, so Rom. Okay. Good stuff. He is going to close it out. But something to notice is that Scarzo has is now ready for shine back air because it's how Rom is ending like all of his combos. Yeah. And Scarzo is not getting caught by the DI mix up anymore. We have a scramble situation here. Rom's going to back up for just a second and shoot a couple lasers. Yeah, it's when Scarzo goes to those platforms. Rom swings with a full hop. Okay. Oh, nice. Wow. That Rom. is actually crazy that he might win the game off this. This is... That's oh so Oh, my funny. God. Rom takes it to game three here. That's actually hilarious because Rom messed up his tech skill and Scarzo did a perfect triple shine and then Rom won because of it. Did he do like a <laughs> sidestep shine there or, so, or just... Yeah, he meant to do shine out of shield, I think. And, and he, he did sidestep. He did sidestep shine instead. That was so funny. While Scarzo was triple shining the air. <laughs> That's melee sometimes. Sometimes, <laughs> yeah. your, sometimes your mistakes can be your best play. Yeah. Maybe he meant to sidestep, because honestly, it's good with Falco. But yeah. I, I think that was a shine out of shield he missed. Good early damage Ooh. here from Scarzo. That was really good, actually, by Scarzo there, because it was SDI from Rom on the jab that got him up, and Scarzo just covered it with a grab. Yep. Rom just looking for that shine by any means. Oh, choppy ledge dash, not punished. Nice ah, dash yeah. attack by Scarzo. Yep. Popping off a little bit for that first stock. Yeah. I mean, they, these guys don't want to be out in losers this early. I don't think so. And given how much we've seen Rom pushing forward, this stage makes so much sense to me as a counter pick. Oh, oh that was cute. No jump. Oh, good what? tech. Oh, they're both so good. They're both so good. They're both so good. <laughs> good damage from Scurzo. Oh, wow. Oh. Oh, get back. Yeah, no, that was, right was kind of ambiguous if, if uh, Falco was recovering there. Yeah. <gasps> Scurzo getting plenty of light hits. He's not rushing it. Mm. Cover center. Oh, wow. What a weird pickup for Rom. That was so strange with the reverse forward air. Oh, he's oh. going to go low. Uh, what? what? He didn't get up attack. That should That's not work. Crazy. Rom should not recover. Okay, I was yeah, going to say. Okay, yeah. He made that stock last a lo longer than it even should have, but two, we'll see if it's two to go. Laser grab. Oh, wow. What a sick ledge dash by Skurzo, but the CC eventually going to pay off for Rom. Ooh. Shine pressure. Rom's been in the corner so much of this game. Yeah. This extra space that Skurzo has to work with has worked so well for him, but Shield Drop back air could do it right here. Yep. Wow. Just roll up. It's going to do it. Rom keeping it even. Can he survive this invincible fox right here? Skurzo takes some time to think. Hey, you'll take that if you're the Falco. Yeah, Falco just has to back off here. Watch out for Fox's back air. Ooh. Oh, wow. The side B hits. This could be huge. Oh, just tear him. Oh. oh. Nice high down air, but that's not going to convert because he's hitting Fox in the air. Nice. Gets to the ledge. Ooh. Is he dead? He's not. Living. He gets to the ground. Wow. He gets the shine. This is huge. There's the shine back air. Oh. oh. Wow. Skurzo wanted to immediate side B again, push, yeah. pushing this text go as far as he can go. But it might not. he might not be able to pull it off. <laughs> oh, my God. He's going for things that are so technical. Rom... Okay, he yeah. finally dies for those double lasers that you pointed out are, are really close to Scarzo. Last stock situation. You can see Rom's trying to catch him now with a shine as he goes to from the side to the top platform. Rom's trying to snipe him out. Oh! oh! No jump! Hi. Oh, oh he's dead. He missed oh, the angle. Oh, no angle. Yeah. Scurzo takes it 2-1. Oof. What a set. That was great. That was my first time seeing Rom, but yeah, really impressed by that aggressive Falco. Mm -hmm.